Hello and Namaste. I'm Devina Gupta and this is Work Life India on the BBC from Delhi. Well, if you're wondering what this is, it's to know more about this, my brain. It's our universe, the central processing unit full of ideas, memories, creativity and much more. But do we really know how to make the best use of it? So I'm here at the Applied Neurosciences Center in South Delhi to find more about it and also to try out this new brain mapping technology. So stay with me as we ask how to train your brain. It's a 30 minute session where I have to close my eyes and the frequencies from my brain are captured by this headset and transferred to a computer. Stand down, you can open your eyes. Okay. <laughs> I feel so refreshed. I was told that these waves on the screen will be further analysed by the team of Neuroleap's founder, Mr. Kumar. And after 24 hours, it's time for the big reveal. How was your experience? Well, honestly, I was a bit scared because I've never done something like this before. And the toughest part for me was to sit still for 30 minutes. Well, one point that got my attention in the report that you shared with me is that my attention span has gone down. And I noticed this particularly because of COVID lockdown, where I found it very difficult to focus on a single task for a long period of time. How did you analyze those colorful waves on the computer to know more about my brain? So whether we like it or not, for far too long, we've been resigned to thinking about the mind. How can I have a tougher mind? Yes, it's good to do that. But to be able to do that, you need to go to the hardware, the brain. So this small piece of hardware has an estimated 100 billion neurons. And it is these connections which are constantly firing electrical energy, which in your case, for example, we used our technology to read that electrical energy, to actually get data. You know, there's a reason why you're behaving that way. And now, you know, we have the technology to understand what those reasons are. And it was an interesting conversation because the technology helped map my brain. And in this conversation, we talked about mood analysis. We talked about attention analysis. We also talked a little bit about memory and how can it be improved using the same technology. 